That's that good. one's annoying. Nice. Oh, that's way up there. I was gonna sit in that chair. Oh. So, so, hey guys, we are talking about belief. Believe in yourself. Believing you can do something. Mm -hmm. And we talk about that a lot. Because it's important. Because it is important. It's the most important. Because it's like the first thing you need to get down in anything. Because mm -hmm. if you don't believe in yourself, you can have anything. Like, you could have any training, any information, and you're going to sabotage yourself because you don't believe in yourself. Mm -hmm. Let me give you an example. Let's say you're, you're uh, first learning how to ride a bike. And... Uh, you, people are saying you gotta get this bike. It's the best bike ever. This yellow bike, it's amazing. It's it's gonna you're gonna be able to ride your bike everywhere and just get it down and ride it as soon as you get this bike. You're like heck, okay, I'll get the bike. But you don't. You're like, but I don't know. I don't really know how to. I don't know how to ride a bike yet. That's what you think. But you go and you buy the bike anyways because everyone says it's an amazing bike. So and you it's get gonna the make bike. you better. It's gonna make you better. You get the bike. You get on there. Poof, fall off. Get on, fall off again. So you're like, huh? You know, it must. Is it? Is it the bike? I think it's the bike. It must be the bike. So you go. You're like, well, let's see what the next best. Like, what's another good bike? So you get another bike, and you get on that bike. Boof, fall off. You're falling off. And what it comes down to is the bike. You think the bike's broken? No, the bike is not broken. What's broken is you. Your belief in yourself. Mm -hmm. You have to believe you can do it before you can do it. People are always like, well, that'll, I can't ever do that. And I always am like, well, yeah, you can't, especially with that attitude. you got to have an attitude that I can do it. I can succeed. Yeah, because, I mean, think about it. The entire world thought that the four, running a four-minute mile was just unachievable until Roger Bannister came along and was like, you know what? Yeah. I'm going to do this. And now, since he's broken that record, tons of people have broken that, and their names aren't even known. Yeah. I don't know who the second one is. I only know who the first was because he believed. I mean, there's a lot of things. If you look out in the world and you think to yourself, you know, I can't do that. You can do that because someone, all, especially if someone's already done it, if somebody's done that, you have within you to do that. Does that make sense? Is you have within right? you the power to do the that. The power to do that, yeah. I mean, you can do that easy. Mm. I mean, maybe not easy. It's going to take work, of course. But if you get it in your mind that you can, then you will. Mm -hmm. Um... So, oh, this, David Wood, the guy, I was listening to him the other day, and before, he met with this guy, and this guy was getting two sales a day, two people to purchase what he had to offer a day, and David Wood, before he heard about that, he thought that was impossible. He was excited. He got two sales a month, and as soon as he knew, like, that that guy was getting two sales a day, like, he was obsessed with that, and he went at it, and he went at it, and he said, I tried, and I tried, but I didn't believe. And until I believed, it was impossible to do. But as soon as I, I had that belief, I didn't get right away. I didn't get the next day, get two sales. I didn't get the day after that. I didn't get a, the day after that. But I believed that I could, so eventually I did. And I'm getting more than two sales a day now. Mm -hmm. So it just comes down to belief. And we want you to believe in yourself because you can do anything. So that's what we have today. And uh, we'll see you guys later. Believe in yourself. And the yellow bike works really well. Alright. Yeah. Specifically yellow. Yep.